Hi everyone, this is Aaron Jones from Cron Electric, and today we're going to talk about one of the major fire hazards in a home, which is arc fault. So everybody's familiar with either the fuse panel they have in the basement or the circuit breaker they have in the basement. And both of those types of devices are built to capture what are called short circuits and overloads. But one of the big major issues in electrical, in your home, is an arc fault. And many people are not familiar with what an arc fault is. New panels and the new technology, they have something called an arc fault breaker. And this breaker is capable of detecting a very dangerous situation, which is called an arc fault. So what is an arc fault? An arc fault, essentially, is when something goes wrong with the wiring in your home. It can either be a broken wire or a loose connection to one of your devices, perhaps one of your lights. Sometimes this can occur just over time. Things get old, connections get loose, things corrode. So if you look here, I'm simulating a broken wire in your home. This spark here can be upwards of 8,000 degrees, possibly up to 10,000 degrees in your wall. But this traditional circuit breaker is never gonna catch this. And the reason for that is the current is too low in the system. But this is a major, major fire hazard. So I'm going to undo that. I'm now going to switch it over to the arc fault breaker. And as I do that, what you'll notice here is once again, when this arc is created, the breaker now trips. After about a second or so of this going on, it detects it and it trips it. How does this do this? If you take a look here, we can see that here's a typical circuit breaker. And here's an arc fault breaker. And the thing to notice about this one is, this one's got a lot more electronics in it. It's just got brains that can determine this type of stuff. So this arc that I showed you is called a series fault. It's series because the arc is happening between a broken connection along the same wire. There's another type of arc fault that we're concerned with, and that's called a parallel fault. The difference here is a parallel fault is a fault that occurs across two wires in your home. For the purposes at home, they're both equally dangerous in terms of starting a fire in your home. And we want to be able to catch both of these situations. This breaker is going to also catch the, this type of fault. As you can see, big flash. Bottom line is, all of these things are hidden in your home. Electrical is mostly hidden behind the walls. People don't see it. They don't think about it. The other place that arc flashes can occur is on actual cords that are plugged into the wall. So often people have plugged in devices into their wall, whether it's a fan, their computer, some lighting. The cords over time get damaged from being walked on, maybe from being smashed in a drawer, maybe from getting something dropped on it. These type of breakers are going to protect against stuff plugged into the wall also. So that's a little bit about arc faults. So how do you protect against them? Again, you want to hire a licensed electrical contractor. If you're in the Hamilton or Niagara area of Ontario, you can call Cron Electric. We'll come in, our experts will take a look at your home, we'll tell you what you need to do to upgrade, to, to be able to put these breakers in to protect you and your family in your home against the dangers of arc fault. <laughs>